So the crypto space got a pretty significant announcement uh, this afternoon, and you are especially happy right now if you're an AVAX holder. So roughly five hours ago, we got the announcement that Amazon Web Services is partnering with Avalanche to help scale blockchain solutions. And we have a thread here from Amin Gun Serer, who is the CEO of Avalanche, and he goes into detail as to why this is different than your typical announcement in the crypto space of a partnership. He says, this is a big deal. It's not your grandfather's AWS partnership announcement. Let me explain in plain English. In the past, other chains have paid AWS to host some nodes and has pitched this as AWS partners with some chain. In reality, some chain was paying AWS. They were a client of AWS. There was no meaningful partnership. This announcement is the exact opposite. AWS recognizes how blockchains are evolving, with subnets serving as app chains, and wants to be one of the hosting providers for the many subnets that people are about to launch. To this end, they will be contributing substantial amounts of AWS credits to projects looking to deploy subnets on Avalanche. They, along with Alibaba, understand where blockchain tech is going, and they want to partner with the one chain that is delivering the vision. Howard Wright of AWS. When you multiply activate times avalanche times subnets, you have something that's a seminal moment. I think blockchain technology will become a commonplace and used in our marketplace by developers. So what does this all mean? Well, basically, if you are a new project or a company or whatever you, you know, whatever entity you are, if you are planning to develop a subnet on avalanche, Amazon Web Services is willing to give you basically a discount on those services, um, which is usually a huge cost for new projects, whatever it may be. That is a significant cost is the the underlying server host. Um, So the fact that they're willing to give credits is a big deal here because like Amin says, in the past, it was usually the other way around, right? Like projects were paying AWS um, via, you know, to host whatever it is that they were doing. And then we're calling that a partnership when really it wasn't exactly a partnership. Um, this is more of, you know, a good mutual relationship between the two. So basically Amazon is giving a discount to people launching on the Avalanche subnets. Um, and in turn, Amazon is going to get more clients from Avalanche and Avalanche of course is going to be able to host these new projects in their subnets for relatively cheap. And from my understanding, they're also going to be putting some plugins or some sort of easy to adapt subnet technology into the Amazon website. So if you're a company or someone wanting to launch a subnet, you'll be able to do it super quick and easy. Um, From the Amazon site, I believe. Uh, I have a TechCrunch article that breaks this down uh, in full. So if you guys want to read through that, it's definitely worth the read. Um, In that TechCrunch article, there's also some quotes from the Amazon representative, which is a pretty big deal in my eyes and shows where Amazon's head is at with this partnership. And it says, looking forward, Web3 and blockchain is inevitable, says Howard Wright, VP and global head of startups at Amazon Web Services, said to TechCrunch, no one can call the time or date or quarter that is going to happen and it'll be mainstream, but... We've seen the cycles of growth before. The velocity of this one seems like an ex- like it's accelerating, and we're just excited to be a part of this. I also have another quote from him uh, from the same article, and he says, We aspire to be strategic long-term partners. It's a differentiating and motivating factor for us, Wright said. So the complement of the subnets and our Activate, we think, is the perfect time, perfect opportunity, and we humbly think we'll look back in years in time and see this as a significant time for blockchain expansion. To me, this right here means more than the AWS credits. To me, this shows that Amazon is actively interested in being partners with Avalanche. Because like Amin said in his thread, so many times have we seen in the crypto space where XYZ company partners with Google or Apple or whoever it is, and you never hear anything from the partner, right? You never hear anything from Google or Apple saying that they're partnering and excited to be partners. It's really just, again, like Amin says, they're using their services and calling them partners, which they kind of are, but it's not like 
these other companies are actively promoting those projects or trying to help them grow. What I see here is that Amazon is actively engaged in this partnership. They want Avalanche to grow uh, because if Avalanche grows, they're going to grow new AWS accounts. So it's a very mutual relationship. And again, I just love what I am hearing um, from Amazon in this case. I love the fact that they are talking about being actively engaged because obviously they're willing, they're going to be willing to promote Avalanche subnets uh, if they know it's going to benefit them. So again, the mutual aspects of this relationship is going to be huge for both parties involved and it's going to be absolutely massive for Avalanche to have this sort of partnership because really, you know, right now, the credits are great. Don't get me wrong. The credits are fantastic. People will be able to start up subnets for relatively cheap um, given the amount of discounts they're getting from Amazon. I'm not exactly sure what the percentage of discount is that they're given. I'm sure it's a case-by-case -case basis. But the fact that they're willing to give any discount at all is a big deal because this is a significant cost to new companies and projects um, that are launching. You know, They have to pay for this service, and it can be pretty substantial. It can be one of their top costs in a lot of cases. Um, so the fact that they're getting a discount there again is, is a big deal. But for me, this is avalanche rubbing elbows with the right people and getting the attention of the right people. Like they clearly have the attention of Amazon right here. Like they are partnering with Amazon in a relationship that is going to be mutually beneficial. So yeah, I thought that this was a pretty big deal. I know a lot of people have been, you know, talking, throwing a lot of hate around about this partnership saying, you know, it's it's all fake and what FUD or whatever. But honestly, like it to me, above everything, the fact that we are getting words like this from Amazon is the significant piece in this. I don't think I've ever seen, you know, a, a company come out and actively talk about partnering with a project, you know, that is as high of profile as Amazon. The fact that Amazon is willing to disclose and talk, you know, openly about this partnership is a big deal to me. So Anyways, guys, yeah, just wanted to share that news with you. If this is your first time to the channel, please like and subscribe. And with that being said, I will see you all next time.